All right, man. So look, I look. This is going. This is not a reaction. This has to be a sit down video, and I need y'all to stay until the end of this video because I need to defend my name. Okay, I need to defend my brand. This depend is not my real name, but this is a brand that I have built from the ground to uh, to this toppity tippity top. Okay, and by people bashing my brand, it causes me to lose out on a lot of big opportunities. So number one. Uh, y'all see the title the reason I hate being black now this is for that was for a marketing reason I need a lot of people to see this video it's not for it's not for the money it's not never no this is the truth okay this is the truth about black people and I need people to stop saying that I'm downplaying my own race nobody's downplaying their own race okay and I I, I hate when people say that because they sit there and say oh Jay oh it depends you're downplaying your own race how about you find Jesus and stop downplaying your own race no first of all I found Jesus I have Jesus I have the Holy Spirit within me. I am a true believer of Jesus Christ, a true follower, not just a believer, a true follower of Jesus Christ. You feel me? Regardless of what your beliefs are, but that is my beliefs. And I and I believe totally. And, in, and I'm in love with Jesus. So don't say that I need to find Jesus. I appreciate that. You feel me? But then don't tag it along with, oh, stop downplaying your own race and find Jesus. Let me tell you something. Now, let's get into this video. I don't wanna I don't wanna hold I don't wanna waste y'all time. I ain't gonna try to make this video uh long, whatever. Hit the like button, subscribe, turn on post notifications, do what y'all do. Whatever I do, okay. The truth about black people. Now, people say I downplay my own race, but this is the truth. This is the truth about black people, and I just point out what's the real and what's the fake, okay? That's all I do. I point out what's wrong within the black community and what they need to be aware of. That's about it. I don't sit there and downplay this race. No, I do not. I love being black. I love my skin color. God made me the way, God created me the way that I am for a reason. He created me in his image. So how can I just hate being black. No, I, I, I don't hate being black, but this is one, uh, number one, racism. Okay. I call out racism a lot within the black community because bro, they sit there and say, Oh, black people give me racist. Black people get No, yes, they can. Black people could definitely be racist, bro. Y'all are racist to your own race. I done heard black people call me the N word so many freaking times and not just with the A I'm talking about with the hard R. But then when a black person, when a white person say it, oh, it's a problem. Oh, it's this. Oh, it's racism. Oh, it's all oh, racism, racism. Oh, I'm going to beat they butt. I'm going to do this. I'm going to do I uh, No, you can't sit there and be hypocritical for something that you already do. And that's a lot of things in the black community. Y'all sit there and be so hypocritical to one another or to another race because they do the same thing that y'all do. But y'all don't feel, y'all don't feel the same when y'all do it to each other. But it hit different when a white person said it to us. How? Then y'all scream racism, but then y'all 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 call each other uh, coons, monkeys, gorillas. Y'all call each other all types of stuff. Oh, that's why you eat a banana for dinner, you little monkey. Yeah, y'all call each other all type of racist crap, but then scream racism when a white person do something to us. Stop being so hypocritical. Stop it. Black people can definitely be racist, and if if, if anybody say black people can't be racist, they are a fool. They are fooling themselves, and they are brainwashed. Seriously. And they need help, okay? Number two, oppression. So as I'm editing, I don't think it really matters, but I just like to do things like this, okay? So I wasn't trying to say oppression. I was trying to say oppressed, but like I said, I don't think it really matters. But anyways, finish joining the video. I call out oppression a lot within the black community, and apparently that's me downplaying my own rights. I, the reason I call out oppression, because I ask black people, what do oppression mean? They, Do you know what they say? Guess what they say? I need y'all to leave me in the comment section below. What did they say? systematically systematically nothing oppression is one definition and one definition only okay and i'm gonna break it down to you oppression is when you don't have the same opportunity as another individual when you are treated differently than another individual that is that is literally what oppression is and if you are living in america i say okay you're living in america right oh yes okay what does the american flag stand for i don't know how the you 30 years old and don't know what the american flag stands for yeah you're crazy the American flag simply stands for freedom and justice. Do your research, people. Do your research. And that's the one, that's another thing I call out in the black community. They don't do research. They 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 take in whatever they're fed. They don't do the research on things. They take in whatever they fed. They they get brainwashed by the media. They get brainwashed by their brainwashed parents. Okay? And and I call out oppression because black people aren't oppressed. Oppression is a freaking mindset. It ain't reality. If you living in America, you're not oppressed. You have the same opportunities that another individual will have. You could be a CEO of a company and be black. You could be a CEO of freaking Amazon. You could be a CEO of YouTube and be black. The reason why white people got these big, these big opportunities, the reason why it's a lot of white CEOs and it's a lot of white people with 
big cars and nice mansions and all this and that that's because they worked for it it's not because it was given to them it's not because it's white privilege no it's because they worked hard for what they have stop saying stop saying black people are oppressed they're not you can have the same opportunity as a freaking white person it's just that black people y'all so lazy and y'all complain so much of what a white person got going on and y'all let a race stop y'all from being successful can i get an amen in the church i'm just saying y'all seriously let white people or stop y'all from being from being successful no i'm not letting no race stop me from being successful if i want to be ceo of this company i could do that because guess what i'm in america and y'all need to be happy that y'all in america y'all not happy enough y'all not proud enough to be in america y'all not grateful Y'all better be grateful that y'all in America. You go to another country, it ain't going to be the same. Granted, America got its own problems, but guess what? It's America, the land of the free. Can I get an amen? Okay, number three, I call out Black Lives Matter. Apparently, that's me downplaying my own race. Me calling out Black Lives Matter and calling out the fake organization and saying that Black lives only matter when a white person shoot us. <laughs> it does. It, it honestly does. That's the only time y'all care when Black Lives Matter. But what about the black babies that's dying every single day by another black person? What about all the black men that's dying every single day by another black person? What about the black on black crimes? The black on black crimes is higher than a white man killing us. But that's all we care about. We don't look at the black on black crimes. What about the black babies that, that that's getting aborted every year? <laughs> oh, y'all quiet now. Yes, the black babies. They lives matter too. I don't care. You can say, oh, they're not a baby technically yet. No, they're lives. But, but guess what? In the Bible, it say that kids are a blessing. Children are a blessing from the Lord above. So how can you sit there and abort a baby? And a lot of black women are having these babies and they're aborting it. They, they, they just killing the baby. But we say black lives matter. They lives matter too. Black people, it, the, the living lives don't matter. Also, the 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 uh, the um, the babies, the babies that's that's being formed in your womb, their lives matter too, no matter what race. So that's why I don't support Black Lives Matter because until y'all stop being, until y'all stop being some hypocrites when it comes to Black Lives Matter and look at everything that's happening in the Black community, then I will say Black Lives do matter. Granted, Black Lives do matter, but guess what? Every other life matter also, not just Black Lives. And I'm tired of people, and I'm tired of this sickening, this sickening organization that Candace Owens already called out. But y'all don't know that because y'all so blinded to the truth. Y'all want to listen to what y'all want to hear. Y'all don't want to listen to me. Y'all don't want to listen to Candace. Y'all don't want to listen to Officer Tatum. Y'all don't want to listen to Black Conservative Perspective. Y'all don't want to listen to LFR family. Y'all don't want to listen to all these other these other black people that should be leading the black community. But no, y'all know who we let lead the black community. All these wannabe thugs. All these thoughts. That, that's who we let lead the black community. That's who we let talk for us. Cardi B. Nikki. Uh, who else? Who else we want to go for? I mean, seriously, we don't allow we don't allow strong black people to lead the black community. We allow these want to be big booty, uh, the, these want to be the hood dudes. Like we allow them to lead the black community. That's what y'all proud of. That's what y'all proud. Of. That's why I call it out, man. It's not me downplaying my own race. That's why I call these things out. Number four, the white the the white uh white people always say. That we have no lives. Oh, white people look at us and say we have no. Well, I'm just putting it like this: white people look at us a certain way. That that that's that that's me. That's me downplaying my own race because I'm telling the truth. That that's me downplaying my own race. That's not me downplaying my own race. I'm just speaking what's true. And guess what? Not all white people look at us a certain way. But you know why people in general look at us a certain way? This is why people in general will look at us a certain way. Because of the things that we do in the community. The things that we do in the black community, the things that's so known in the black community, that's why they, we look at each other. Uh, that's, why we, that's why they look at us a certain way. And then we can't even say white people look at us a certain way. Black people look at black people a certain way. Y'all will trust, y'all will be more comfortable around a group of white people than y'all will be around the black people. Am I lying? Am I seriously sitting here lying? No, I'm not. Y'all will leave y'all wallet around a group of white people before you leave it around a freaking black person. And when y'all see a black person with tats, do rags, cuts in his eyes, big earrings, y'all automatically assume that the man is a thug. Black people think that about black people. Stereotypical. But y'all say, oh, the white people look at us this way. No, we look at each other this way. 
This is what we look at each other as. Stop saying I'm downplaying my own race when I'm just speaking the facts. Tell me I'm lying. I'm telling the truth. I'm telling the truth. When I'm at a party, I will be more comfortable being at a party with a whole bunch of white people in the circle saying, singing their songs and doing their dances. I will be more comfortable around a drunk white person. I don't know about that because when, when they get drunk, they get crazy. You feel me? If you know, you know. But I'm just saying, I'll be more comfortable around white people than I would black people. I'm going to be honest because we don't know what will happen in a black party. Shootings always happening, fights always breaking out, people can't love one another, we always kill another race, like, come on, bro, it's just ridiculous, ridiculous, stop being hypocritical, I got one more for y'all, slavery, I call out slavery so much because this is black people tool, they use slavery, they use slavery as this one big thing, which it was big, it was big, but then they use it in the year 2022, and think that we're still separated. Think that there's still uh, uh, white people selling us into to, uh, freaking uh, slavery. When there's not. We're not tied to nothing. We're not tied to nothing. We're in the land of the free. So I'm confused on why people keep bringing up slavery. Then they say, oh, white people blame your ancestors. No, don't blame your ancestors. Because guess what? They don't even know their freaking ancestors. Just like you don't know your ancestors. Stop telling, black, tell, stop telling white people to blame their ancestors when they don't even know their ancestors. You don't know your ancestors. Nobody know their ancestors. Your ancestors could have sold black people into slavery. Because one thing that black people don't know is that black people was selling black people into slavery. But y'all don't know that because y'all only listen to what y'all being fed. Do your research, people. Seriously. Do your research. I'm not sitting here dragging black people. I'm sitting here speaking the truth. That's all I'm doing. I don't need people telling me I'm downplaying my own race. No, I love being my race. But when we use slavery and we use it and we use it to so people can baby feed us and feel sorry for us, I'm sorry, but that's just so hypocritical. That's so hypocritical because guess what? Black people, y'all play about slavery. Oh, do I got to bring up all the videos of black people uh, playing about slavery? I just seen a video not too long ago of a, um, <coughs> it was funny. It was funny. But the lady, she was like, uh, was you pick, was you pick cotton for $200 an hour? Now I know we all go say, heck yeah, $200 an hour, girl, what? I would do that proudly. And she said, <laughs> and she ran through a field. With a whole bunch of with a whole bunch of cotton. It was like a it was green skin. Green screen. She had on like the, the slavery dress with the with the little hat and everything. She said, Freedom! <laughs> Bro, the funniest video I have ever watched in my life. But it's crazy to me how if a white person did the same thing, it would have went crazy. They would have got so bad for it, but we can do it because we're black. I'm tired of that. I'm tired of that. If y'all go care about slavery so much and y'all care about being called boy and y'all care about being called the N-word, then stop calling other black people black people. Stop calling other black people the N-word. Stop calling other black people boy. Stop making fun of slavery if it's not really funny, okay? If it's, if a white person can't do it, then y'all shouldn't be able to do it either, okay? I'm just saying. I'm saying they should be able to do whatever we do because guess what? We in the land of the free. Y'all scared these white people so much to not say the N-word, man. Y'all, man, what? Let me be white. I would have said that in word like crazy because guess what? I'm not going to let no other race stop me from saying a word that's just a word. And, it, and it's not, it's not, it's not nothing compared to what it was back then because y'all say it so loosely. Black people say it so loosely. Y'all let me know what y'all think in the comment section below. Uh, I know I didn't really have to make a response video to this, but I truly just had to call out what's, what's the real and what's the fake. Okay. This is why I call out all these things. This is the truth about black people. But the title may say I hate being black or this is the reason I hate being black. It's just for the marketing. I just need y'all to really watch the video, okay? Because I need this to be out there. I need to really protect my brand. So I need it to be out there. But anyways, man, I love y'all. Thank you for watching. Y'all some goats. I need y'all to hit the like button. Hit the like button. Subscribe to my post notifications. What I'm to do is be your boy, the pan. God bless. Stay blessed. Peace.